Real hot girl shit. Ah. Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. So in today's video, I'm using voice memo just to have a little more control on what I say during a vlog. And right now I'm showing you what I do 90% of my summer, which is crocheting. And right now I'm showing you that I'm trying to make a new sweater that is black and as the base and then using red burnet yarn as the puff sleeves. And I'm really excited to try because this will be my first attempt. And what I'm also showing you right now is I made a baby blanket for one of my relatives is going to have a baby soon. So I made a blanket, just completed it over the last month. And here's two baby hats that kind of match the theme and two little mitts. I don't know if it fits a newborn, but you know, I don't have a baby to measure, so. Hey guys, so I'm going to get some coffee like usual and I just wanted to say like for YouTube, I've been very confused about what to post, what I should make content on. So for this video, I'm just going to be experimenting like crazy and just mashing up a bunch of videos just to see how it turns out. There was a really nice lady at the masjid near my house and she was offering Somali classes. So all of my siblings joined in and we were learning the basics that day. And we ended the class doing Somali bingo and basically teaching us how to learn like animal names and i really like this section because i won and i know i was a grown person but i was excited <laughs> we also watched the conjuring around the end of june i didn't really like that movie very much i know that's an unpopular opinion but i just felt like the conjuring three wasn't giving me what i wanted from the series it wasn't as scary i just felt like it was not I could not take it serious so but i was happy i got to watch it for the first time and yeah my siblings kind of agreed and here's a bonfire that i went to it was an event hosted by daru salam and we were basically listening to like a halaqa about like mercy and i really liked the message but i don't want to sound vain but i basically came because i heard there was a bonfire and i wanted more of the community aspect like i was just really excited to come join to go watch a fire because i'm more of an indoor person so i don't really get to go out and make bonfires like that or go camping so it was really nice to just enjoy i made a new friend when i was at that event and i just really liked it i just felt really at peace just sitting there and watching the flames and this is where most Minnesotans go when we have nothing better to do with our lives, which is go to the Mall of America. And I just got some chat time, didn't think it was necessary to film, but I'm showing you right now that the Nickelodeon universe is officially open. So because the mask mandate and quarantine is over, any kid can come and play again. And here's 36 Cafe. I went there because a few of my friends were posting about going there on their social media on Instagram and it is gorgeous. I really really liked it and the food was super affordable. It was literally like $10 for a full meal and I really liked how it gave you aesthetics and their playlist was surprisingly literally in my playlist and I just loved the backdrop that they have, this little phone thing. It's so pretty. I loved everything about it and the food is just so nice. I mean, it felt like dessert to me. It was literally ice cream you could see on the left and pancakes. And then my sister got the matcha delight, delicious stuff. And that's the end of my vlog. I know it's a really short one, but you know, I just wanted to post quality content and you know, that's all I got. So I'll see you in my next video. Bye.